to use. Medical experts say the abuse of tramadol, a pain relief drug, can cause psychotic problems as well as cause damage to vital human organs. The drug, despite being prescription only, is sold and used indiscriminately by young people in Ghana. As part of efforts to raise awareness about the dangers of drug abuse, the youth wing of Satellite Methodist Church in Accra has held a program dubbed Gobberfest 2018. Speaking at the program, medical practitioner and clinical health psychologist Dr. Isaac Newman Arthur expressed concern at the growing illicit trade in tramadol by unlicensed pharmacists. Anybody we find using tramadol, we have to just match the person to the pharmacy or the person who sold the tramadol to that person. And the person should be prosecuted. He called on persons battling with addiction to seek medical help. The people involved, they need help to be able to overcome those addictions. And there are psychiatrists, psychologists, we have uh, counselors, we have uh, psychiatric nurses and people in, in the health profession who have been trained to deal with those problems. Mental health nurse and second runner-up of last year's Ghana's Most Beautiful Pageant, Baba Boche, also called for more awareness creation about the dangers of drug abuse. When you have a lot of information concerning something, you go out there and then deliver well. And also you are able to understand the condition that people find themselves in and then not to judge them, but rather help them out of it. Other speakers of the program cautioned the youth against indulging in social vices. And now to politics. A newly appointed director of communications of the new patriotic party, Yao Bwabing Asamwa, has assured party faithful of a collaborative communication strategy which will ensure the inclusion of foot soldiers and party serial callers. His comments follows a strike by serial callers of the ruling MPP in the Shanti region who complained of neglect 